Welcome to our first video of chess trap series. Here we learn different chess traps, tips and tricks. And today we are going to discuss Guico piano trap. Suppose you are playing with the white pieces, so game starts with the e4. Black reply with the e5. White play knight to f3 attacking on this. Or simply black will defend. That's the most common defense. Now white play bishop to c4 and this is Italian opening. And what if black reply with the bishop c5? Then this is called Guico Piano. This position is called Guico Piano and trap starts from here. Now white to play. So white here white try to attack the center and and try to uh, attack on this bishop right because this is the best piece of the black so white try to uh, deflect this piece so what will white will do will play c3 and then black will generally defend this pawn then white can play d4 attacking this pawn and the uh, bishop here there are two three things here but this pawn is defended by our knight and the queen so exchange will be one pawn down for black so what black will generally do here he can either retreat this bishop back or he can take this or he can exchange for the knight these are the options so let's suppose uh, black try to take it then white will take it and here again uh, black can take this black will try to take this or will retreat back and suppose uh, black try to take it suppose black try to take it and as you can see the engine it's already plus 7.8 because this is the best piece of the black and black decided to exchange this so white is happy in exchanging of all these pieces as you can see it is already plus 8 for white and you can see uh, white is one piece up so white can easily win from here but what if let's suppose at this point uh, here black first goes for the exchange but what if he doesn't go for exchange and he retreat his bishop back in this case white can create a trap like bishop bishop to b5 uh, pinning this knight right and suppose uh, black will try to attack on this pawn because this is the bish, uh, this is the um, what to say this is the weak pawn undefended pawn so black will play something like knight f6 right knight f6 and as you can see knight f6 he is trying to attack on this with the knight so black uh, white can easily push this pawn to attack this and here she a trap this bishop is def is controlling this diagonal and what will what will happen if this bishop controlling the diagonal and this knight come from here and then here then this is a fork and he can easily win the queen black can think like this and so black will play like uh, knight take if e4 right but white continue this as you can see already engine says is plus 4 and then white will create its fork sorry i mean black will create its fork but there is a discovered check that black missed here and that's when he played this there is a discovered check by bishop and suppose black try to defend it with the bishop then there is again a check and this queen get defended as you can see so black has to move black moved there and you can say already engine says is plus 11.5 you can win the rook here queen has to go you win the bishop and knight in this way black is in huge trouble because this uh, king is uh, is not safe this uh, rook is uh, is not in the action this bishop is the only piece that is active this knight is going to be trapped finally i mean this bishop is also going to be exchanged soon like this 
right and this knight can easily come over here so as you can see already is plus 12 so these are the traps here at this point right if e takes if the if the position is if e takes d4 right but suppose he doesn't take but suppose he doesn't take and decided to uh, put this bishop back i mean bishop b6 then the best move for white is to uh, get this pawn he has done this now here there are two things can possible either this pawn take or either this pawn take or this knight take let me first let us first see what happen if this pawn take right suppose it took the pawn uh, suppose it took e5 pawn with the pawn you already see engine says is plus 1.4 it's because because something and now you will do the queen exchange that's the best move he has to go and then uh, black, white can win a uh, pawn here and you can see it's already plus 2.4 2.5 well from here white can easily develop his knight and this knight is most powerful in the black's territory and controlling all the pieces right controlling all the centers easily so this is dominating uh, knight at this point instead of taking like like this at this point instead of taking with the uh, instead of taking with the pawn he can take with the knight and if he take with the knight the best move for white is to take that with the knight suppose he take suppose he take with the uh, pawn then there is a trick here that's a check and if that's a check and if if black uh, if black was not careful he will take that bishop and finally he loses his queen and it's already plus nine in the engine this is how he can win the queen but what if black will not take this and he saw that uh, white is going to take the queen so he will defend this by playing king to e7 even in that case uh, the best move for white is to take this he will have to take and as you can see this is already plus three because this king is not safe the white has this developed piece white can easily develop this white can easily castle and save his queen and this knight can easily come over here and the best square for this bishop whenever this bishop is attacked he can easily come over here right on b3 so there are many moves for white to play so it's it's that's why it's plus three i mean totally a piece up right now after after all of these moves and the problem starts here at this point engine says there is no mistake suppose what what black will do black will not fall into this trap so what black will do black will play simply simple like this italian opening then guico piano then guico piano and then white try to attack the center and at this point engine says both are equal and let's suppose he retreat back he take it he take it at this uh, taking with the knight is a mistake right so suppose he didn't take that with a knight but take that with a with a pawn that's also a problem right so what is the best move at this point both are equal but what is the best move for black the best move for black is to play queen to e7 attacking this pawn right so the best move for white is to take that pawn i mean take that free pawn and that's where black can give a check by winning a pawn uh, bishop has to go back and then again give a threaten to take it here so white has to castle and then he can easily win that free pawn in this way both are equal i mean almost plus one the best move here for white is to exchange the queen 
because this pawn is being isolated right this pawn is got isolated and white has this uh, this this square that is the best square for this white right and white can easily control the opponent territory by going there uh, white can also develop this knight and develop this this uh, bishop here and there is a discovered uh, check can can by the rook on e1 right so there are many moves for white to play that's why it's plus one so even if black plays his best move white can have a winning chances by playing that so and the trap that was guico piano trap is winning that piece winning that queen if black miss so this is it for today i am a chess player and i am a chess student by the way and you can give me any suggestion any uh, improvement any mistake that i have made uh, because this is my first video thank you